Have you ever had a flood of emotion that you just couldn't get rid of? You know, when you're really angry or pissed off to the core of your being and you just can't seem to get rid of it. If so, you're in the right place. I'm Amy with another AHA moment. So the other night I was watching this TV show and the, one of the characters was having a rough time. She was so incredibly angry at her husband and she couldn't move past it. And the therapist in the TV show didn't really say anything and the character said to the therapist, I know you have a comment or an opinion on this. And all the therapist said was hysterical is historical. I'm gonna repeat that, hysterical is historical. And the main character said, please, please enlighten me, explain this. And what she explained was when we get triggered and we have an, a, a massive emotion that comes through that we kind of fester and hold on to, it's due to a historical moment in our lives, something that has happened to us that has been triggered. And so when we have that abundance of energy that we don't seem to be able to process through, Take a moment and sit with it and think of a time in your life that it has triggered. What happened previously that has triggered that emotion and what does that mean to you? And when we move past that, when we move through that, when we are aware of what happened in our past that this incident has triggered, we'll have the ability to move through it. We'll have ability to heal from it. We'll have the, the decision, the choice to decide what to do with it instead of just holding on to that anger or that hurt or that frustration. So, as always, if you like this video, please let me know by clicking that thumbs up or like button below and subscribe to my channel. If you hit that bell icon, you'll get notified the next time I upload a video. I do these things for you and if you know of somebody who really could use this information, by all means, share it with them and I hope that you're having an amazing day. We'll see you next time.